welcome back to my channel i'm ill at the minute so please ignore my voice i literally sound horrendous um but i'm filming a huge wardrobe organization and declutter today if you've watched some of my recent videos you'll know that i'm moving apartment so soon um and i have too much shit that i need to get rid of it's also just so so messy because i've been traveling a lot i've come back from holiday a couple of weeks ago but i also didn't i unpacked but i didn't like fully organize and pack and everything is just everywhere i want to organize it into piles as well because stuff like my bikinis i'm not going to need them like till summer now so it seems a bit pointless like having them fully in my wardrobe so i'm gonna see if i can like organize them somehow i might even try to start to put some stuff into like boxes or suitcases that i'm not going to use before we move i got this headband from primark and i can't tell if i love it or if i'm giving like david beckham back in the day you know when he saw his headbands literally the last thing i want to do right now is organize my wardrobe i don't know why i've always put it off so much but I literally have no excuse not to do it now. I have no plans today. So, well, I did some stuff this morning, but apart from that, I'm a free woman. So I need to be organized and motivated. I feel like this is probably going to take me the next, like, four hours. I'm not going to lie. If I'm motivated and not distracted, then it will take me less. But I know what I'm like. And halfway through, I'll have, like, an hour TikTok break. So I need to not do that. I currently am resembling that I've just been, like, let out from prison or something with this outfit. I've got a matching Dre, Dre? I've got a matching grey tracksuit on. I've got my Zara like wide leg joggers on. And my Adenola jumper, which I literally live, breathe, and die in. Um, but it's just comfy and it's just what I wanted to wear today when I feel like crap. It actually makes me laugh sometimes how I come on my YouTube channel. But like on TikTok, I'm like, oh god, no, I gotta look good here. Whereas on YouTube, I just, I literally don't give a fuck. Everyone send a prayer for me and I'll organise my wardrobe now. Just starting this off by saying, please don't judge me for the state it's in. I have started to like pull some stuff out of the wardrobe and the wardrobe is open. And everything is everywhere. Basically, it's kind of hard to buy your boyfriend birthday presents when you literally live with him. Because, like, where am I going to hide this to? We have a small apartment. Like, where am I supposed to be hiding this stuff to? So, I hid it in my wardrobe for a bit. But now I'm like, well, I need to sort out my wardrobe. So, where are they going to go? So, I've now hid them in a suitcase. So, hopefully, he doesn't find them there. But, um, yeah. This is what we're working with. I know it's absolutely horrendous. I also have clean clothes behind me here i have a random deodorant stick there for like no apparent reason so it just needs to get sorted at this point i think i'm gonna start by just taking everything out and just have a huge pile of mess on the floor and then i'm gonna organize it into piles or try and semi-organize it while i'm pulling all the stuff out i feel like this is gonna be kind of hard to film but hopefully you can see all right i'm just gonna take all of my stuff out this jacket I absolutely love. I've had from PLT for years. It's kind of getting a bit manky though. I am going to keep it, but I do think next year it's going to have to be its last year. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to try to keep my jackets and stuff like what I want hung up on the hanger so it's just easier to put back in. I'm such a blazer girl, so I literally have probably at least 10 blazers in my wardrobe. Absolutely not getting rid of her. Another blazer. I literally never wear this, so I'm going to put this on Vinted. Um, I'll leave my Vinted in the description if anyone wants it, but I think it's literally just Molly O'Flaherty. I'm trying to have the mentality is if I've not worn it in a certain amount of time, then I'm not going to wear it again, so I just need to get rid. This Topshop denim jacket I've had since I was in about year nine, but I just can't part with it. And I don't really own another denim jacket, so I guess that's a staple as well. Another blazer that I love from Primark. And then I've got some like oversized flannel sort of shirts. But I think I can fold these up because I don't really wear them like on a daily basis. When Liam gets back from football, he is going to be like, what the fuck has exploded in here? Because it's just going to be a bomb site. Out of us two, I'm definitely the messy one in the relationship. And then like I'm very organised and like cleaning and tidying. But... I think I've just got so much stuff compared to boys. Like, I've got so many, like, makeup products, skincare products, clothes, shoes, bags. Like, boys just have their set amount of things and their set things that they wear and then that's it. But I have too much stuff, to be honest. I'm going to make a jumper section as well. 
I need to get rid of this just because I've had it for so long. And you know when like the material starts to go a bit like weird and bubbly. This is from Zara. By the way, if I say I'm getting rid of it, it's either going on Vinted or going to the charity shop. So I'm not just chucking it out. I got this set for my birthday, which I love from Marsa Label. I've only worn it once. So I definitely need to get some more wear out of it. I'm going to make a pile for like joggers as well. I need to make a pile for like nice dresses and like nice clothes that I just wear when I go out really because this sort of stuff I'm not wearing like on the weekly basis. These need to go in the bin. I don't know why. I absolutely love these leggings. I didn't even get them that long ago. Let me pause that. But they literally have like bleach or something down the side of them and I can't get it out. So I think I'm going to have to chuck these out, unfortunately. Wait, was it even this pair? Oh, now I'm stressed. Now I don't know if it is this pair. I can't really see anything on it. I do love these, but I've literally not worn them in years. So I think they're going to have to go as well. Liam's just got a like debobbler. Is that even what they're called? They're definitely not called that. They basically like get all the bubbles off of your clothes. Um, so he's brought that. I can't wait to use that one because I've got so many things that like like jumpers and stuff that are literally fine, but they just have loads of bubbles on. So I'm excited to use that. If anybody follows Daisy and Ellie O'Donnell, do you remember when they did these in the O'Donnell's collection? Because I literally love that. I'm pretty sure they brought them out in like covid time but i still have these even though i've lost like the actual like drawstring but i can't throw these away just for memories you know i was looking for this top for ages it's from rooster and ready and they're such good quality i've got a gray one as well that i'm obsessed with but yeah i was literally searching for this for ages Okay, the wardrobe is now finally empty. This does not look organized at all. It is actually in piles, even though it's actually embarrassing, it does not look like it. But basically I'm gonna start by hanging all of my blazers and my jackets up, and then I'm gonna fold all of my pajamas and put them into this white basket here. Pajamas are all folded up in here now. Luckily, when we move into the new place, we've got already built in wardrobes. So I'm thinking to get some like more baskets to go like at the bottom of the wardrobe and on the top. I'm gonna put all of my jeans and trousers on the top shelf. <laughs>
starting to get there a little tiny bit now um i'm gonna put my bags in this corner and then all of this like summer stuff slash nice dresses which i don't wear that often i think i'm, I'm gonna pack away in a case just because we're gonna be like moving it again soon anyway and i'm not gonna need it like on the day to day so i think i'm gonna do that guys this literally feels illegal it feels like i'm packing to go away but i'm not i'm staying in england so that's a bit unfair i'm not gonna lie Anyway, I'm just going to put all of my, like, summer slash fancy stuff that I don't really wear very often in the suitcase. Oh, half of this is still gym stuff and stuff that I will wear. just for like not even a quarter of my wardrobe like that has literally filled up half the suitcase already i'm gonna leave the suitcase um here for a bit just in case i have any more like holiday clothes or clothes i'm not really gonna wear in this set of chest of drawers here because i can already see the key open up there hi everyone i can't lie it's the next day now i started to feel so ill yesterday so I thought I'd just carry on the wardrobe organisation slash declutter today. Um, I'm going to start on these drawers because, again, these are a mess. I've still got a lot of holiday and slash summer bits in there. So I'm going to continue to put them in the suitcase. And then I'm going to take everything out and then put everything back in. I cannot say I've ever worn this, so I need to get rid of it. I always keep it because I'm like, oh, that'd be so cute for work, but, like, my work's very casual, and I just don't really like it, to be honest, so I'm going to put it on vintage, I think. Baby, you give me ice and fire. You're giving me wind and rain. Some of my tops are already kind of, like, folded up and organised in here, so I'm just going to leave these ones in. Some kind of butterfly Baby, you give me this night up You whip up my appetite Don't leave me here high and dry I think for this middle drawer, because it's quite a lot bigger, I'm going to keep my tracksuits and the rest of my hoodies in there. I've also got some gym clothes in there, so hopefully it will all fit in. This bottom drawer is so messy. I've clearly just shoved all of my holiday stuff in there. I like to be educated, but I'm so frustrated. Hello to my loneliness. I guess that ignorance is bliss. Take me back to be
okay all well my um track suits are in this drawer now the top drawer i've just got tops in it is organized it doesn't really look like it but i've got so many like little flimsy tops so it's kind of hard to like fold them and then in the bottom i still have quite a lot of room <laughs> in this bottom drawer um but i've just got all my like kind of like going out outfits more like skirts nice top stuff like that in the bottom i have this pile of gym clothes to fold up and put away and then i've also got this pile of clothes still which is just like jumpers and stuff which i need to find room for i like to be away in my patient stay up i feel so outdated Look the other way, sun is out, but the sky is gray. What would happen if I took a chance? It's always hard at first glance. I don't wanna, but I know I gotta do it. The truth is hard to swallow, I think I'll chew it. finally done with the wardrobe it's not perfect but because i'm moving so soon i'm gonna have to just like mix everything up again anyway um but i feel so much better for it being tidy and like decluttered um so i've got all of my like trousers jeans bottoms up here and then i've got some of my flannel shirts all of my blazers coats i've got some jumpers and some of my t-shirts that i wear a lot here then i've got some bags there pajamas and gym clothes and then in these drawers, I've got my tops in this one, my joggers there, and then the bottom is just more like going out clothes. I also have a big pile of clothes in a black bag that I need to put on my vintage slash take to the charity shop. So I'm going to do that a bit later today. I did my heat this curler last night, so this curl is a bit crazy, but it was a soft one from Primark for £3. And it was so good, it was so comfy to sleep in. I've only taken these out about an hour ago, so this is why they're still quite crazy, but they will calm down throughout the day. Thanks for giving me the motivation to do this because I've been feeling so unwell. I've just been putting it off, but I feel a lot better now it's done. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see all of the moving and organising vlogs. I think I'm going to do a organise my new apartment with me video when I move. Let me guys know if you'd like that because I don't know if to include that as part of the moving vlog or do a separate one. Yeah, I'm just undecided on what to do at the minute. I just want to remind everyone that I'm also uploading loads on YouTube shorts and on my TikTok. So if you want to follow me over on there, then please do. My TikTok is Mole O'Flaherty. Um, so yeah, if you want to follow, I would absolutely love that so much. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Mm -hmm.